Linking and Loading What is linking? After all of the files are compiled, they must be merged together to produce a single executable file that the user use to run the program. In C, most compiled programs produce results only with the help of some standard programs called as library files that reside in the computer. This process is called linking. The result obtained after linking is called the executable file. To build an executable file, the linker collects and libraries. The linker's primary function is to bind symbolic names to memory addresses. To do this, it first scans the files and concatenates the related file section to form one large file. Then, it makes a second pass on the resulting file to bind symbol names to real memory addresses. Linking is the process of taking some smaller executable and joining them together as a single large executable. Loading the executable into memory prior to execution. There are two types of linking. Static linking, dynamic linking. Static linking occurs at compilation time. Hence, it occurs prior to loading a program. With static linking, the external symbols that are used by the program, example function names, are resolved at compile time. Dynamic linking occurs at runtime, so it occurs after or at the time of the loading of a program. With dynamic linking, the symbols are resolved either at loading time or at runtime when the symbol is accessed. Lazy binding. What is loading? After the files are compiled and linked, the executable file is loaded in the computer's memory for executing by the loader. This process is called loading. Program loading is basically copying a program from secondary storage into main memory so it's ready to run. In some cases, loading is just not copying the data from the disk to the memory but also setting, protecting bits or arranging for virtual memory map virtual addresses to disk pages.